What's up, everybody? This is Tark, and I completely forgot what I was going to say. Oh, yeah. Welcome to Stick in the Mud live cast. So, today, I'm taking a look at the Reddit slash r slash mud mud of the month, which is Luminari. Luminari, uh, from what their website says, is a mud based on, oh, whatchamacallit, uh, Pathfinder and the D20 rule system, which I think is awesome. I love playing tabletop, and if there's a game that emulates tabletop rules, well, I mean, there's nothing to not love there. So... With that all being said, you know, let me double check their website, make sure I'm not. Oh yeah, so anyways, uh, their website, luminarymud.com. If you want to connect, play along, or just check it out while I'm there, uh, the web, the address is luminarymud.com, port 4100. So, let's go ahead and connect. Now, I'm using the latest version of Mudlet, and when you launch the game with the latest version of Mudlet, uh, it'll automatically download their graphical user interface that they've been working on which pretty cool so okay gotta make an account name you know let me I'm gonna make that invisible for a second so I can get that knocked out here do 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 do, do. password password all right, let's go ahead and make that visible again. There we go. All right, and hopefully if anybody chats at me, I should see it, hear it, all that fun jazz. Make sure everything's up and running. Yes, everything is up and running. No viewers yet, but hey, the night is young, and I'll be doing this for a little while here. So, all right, so let's make a new character. Do do. My new character, what will he be called? I mean, assuming I'm going to be a he. I think today I'm going to be a he again. Nah, you know what? I'm going to be a female. Um, New female, what's she going to be called? Let's go... Ah, I really wish I could see races before having to name a character. You know, one of those things that I think some games could stand to... Uh, to implement would be letting you see, you know, some of the character creation stuff before you have to actually select a name. Oh, names, names, names. You know, we're just going to go to our fun, fun name generator. FantasyNameGenerators.com, by the way, is like the absolute best website for getting names. Uh, let's see here. Hey, Curdy. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, and I wondered, did that actually... Uh, let's see. Can I add... You know, we'll go ahead and put that over right there, I think. So, that means, hey, people should be able to see the chat, which, well, cool. Then you can make fun of each other, or, you know, do whatever it is you all want to do. All right, so, fantasy name generator, I want... Oh, Let's go with. Whew, man, so many choices. Ooh, Valkyrie names. There we go. All right, so we are gonna be. Svenel. At least that's how I'm gonna pronounce it. 
Yes, that is my name. Female. Races. Human, elf, dwarf, halfling, half elf, half orc, and gnome. Type human if you don't know what to pick. You know, humans are fairly solid, but kind of have a character in my actually no, let's go human quick to master extra skill at first level extra skill points additional skill point each level uh oh do they not get stat mods i guess not what about gnomes combat training and for vision good against illusions concentration listen con strength uh, hmm. Elf? No. Half elf? No. Halfling? Ah, man. Okay. None of the races that I really want to get in there with. So let's go ahead and then we'll go with the human. I think that'll sync up the best with me. Uh, yes, I want to be that race. And thanks for that, Curdy. Uh, <clears throat> ah, excuse me. All right, so standard Pathfindery D and D classes, and I am going to make a sorcerer. I always love sorcerers; they are one of my favorite classes, just because of how adaptable they are. Smaller spell selection than wizards, but you don't have to prepare them ahead of time, and that's uh, that's always nice. So, da da, -da arcane. Raw power, they don't know as many spells, get them slower, but don't have to prepare. Uh, let's see here. Skill points, int modifier times four. Int, though, isn't all that important for a sorcerer, so, which is a nice thing. Okay, alignment. Ah, you know, I'm going to go with... I like chaotic neutral. It, it's my get all, can do anything you want with it alignment. Always a nice thing. So let's see here. Create a new profile. I've already one first. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah, that's just telling me how to get that all up. Okay, let's enter the game. See if. Oh, it's not automatically populating the stuff. I kind of thought it might. You know, let me go into settings real quick. And let's use MDSP instead of GMCP. Close. Save the profile. Reopen Mudlet. Reconnect Luminari. Get rid of Mudlet for a second here. Pull Mudlet back up and let's log in with Svenel. Hey, there we go. Now we're seeing some stuff pop up. You notice the hit point, movement gauges, XP gauge. Not sure what that empty little box right there does yet. Uh what else and yeah i would say for right now uh not really important to see the stuff on in that cool little box there it's just the basic oh character name level and some other stuff where it doesn't really look like it's doing a whole lot yet let's hit the map if we type look or if we move uh, it's not populating Let's see here. Let me check settings, see if there's a map to download. No, what if I hit you and move? No, okay. Well, you know what? For right now, we're going to go ahead and go with the default auto map that's showing up to the right of descriptions. So, welcome. You chose to be a sorcerer. You need equipment. What all do I start with? Some robes, a dagger, pants, sleeves, a quiver, a bow. Interesting. Uh, 
We've got some color going on. It's not horrifically annoying except like the dark gray against my black background here. I can barely read on the dagger. The water skin, a little difficult to read again. So, if you've listened to me live stream or anything like that before, uh, I generally tend to really not like what I consider misused color, uh, for lack of a better way to put it. So, let's see, wield a weapon, limited space, put stuff in a pack. Okay, what skills do I have? Uh, oh, did I mean spells? You know, maybe I did. Spells command requires at least one argument. Spells feats? I don't know any feats. Oh. Feats. First level arcane spell, simple weapon proficiency. Help, simple weapon. May use all simple weapons. Help, bow. Huh. Okay, let's wield the dagger. Let's wear the pack. Let's put all pack. We've got that bow, some whey bread. Gotta love the whey bread. Ah, let's see. Water skin, a torch. Ooh, get torch from pack. Get teleporter from pack. Let's look at the teleporter. Use transfer plays between zones, successful zones, with home zones being capitalized. Teleport to wizard training mansion, which is okay. I like that. Ooh, account XP. No, oh, of course it shows my account name. That's all right, though. I use a different password than I usually use. What all can you unlock? Weapon Master, Arcane Archer, Stalwart Defender, a Shifter, and a Duelist. What about races? Half Troll, Crystal Dwarf, Trelux, Arcana Golem, and a Drow. What is a tr I feel like I should know what that is. They're small. Oh, basically uh, Three Green from Dark Sun. Okay. Insect people are cool. Not usually my cup of tea unless, well, I'm feeling really, really frisky that day. So, all right. Enter to enter portal, exit the tutorial. Not, you know, let's go ahead and go through the tutorial because I get the feeling there's going to be just enough that's different. What was it? Train to see your abilities. Hey, there we go. Class abilities, concentration, spellcraft. Those are going to be super important. Lore. What is that actually? I mean, wow, they've got all the skills, which is awesome. So like help diplomacy. What does diplomacy do for me? How well you can taunt. Oh hey, you know what? For nine o'clock my time, ten players online, that's not half bad. Let's see, one, two, three. Four, five, six. Oh, so seven players and then admins. I'm sure, there's you know, probably a couple of AFKers out there, but that's all right. So let's go east. Inside the training halls. It's a very nice training hall. Very simple. They just want to move you along. Uh, okay, there's a Seneschal. Seneschal. What up, Shenny? Well dressed, bald human. Oh, let's look at me. I'm a medium human. There's nothing special about me. Well, yeah, for right now. Oh, hey, their little uh, chat capture works apparently just fine. Awesome. You know, I one of these days I'm gonna do a stream where I sit down and do a interface from scratch, just so a everyone can see my terrible, terrible coding ability because I really think that needs to be shared with the world. Crafting skill, okay. Boost. 
I have no boost. Okay. Spells Sorcerer. Known spell list. Spell circle level one. Help. Known spell list. Help. Spell circle level one. No. Help. No, let's check help sorcerer. Class feats sorcerer. Weapon proficiencies. Okay. Oh, so that's the stuff you get from. Okay, anyways. Let's move along here, I guess, for right now. Good to know that word spreads fast around adventurers. Quarry? I don't call you quarry. So, let's see. Door needs to be unlocked with a key. Open box. Get key box. Unlock door. Open door. You can do the direction thing. Oh, command queuing. Nice. So, let's see here. Training halls, some more. And what looks like, you know, a unique description for each room, which, you know, I know a lot of folks, you know, hit or miss, but, all right, I want spells and feats training. Hi, Adoreal. I'm just going to call you real for short. Feat systems based off D&D. &D. Okay, well, let's learn about feats, because I don't know about feats here. So edit in a menu that lists controls how you spend your feet points. They can improve or add abilities to your character, which is a caster, super important. I uh, can improve or add to your character and unlock equipment and weapons. You can customize your character. Okay, so let's use study. All right. Very nice. So if you type one, it'll bring you to the feats menu. Go to the menus, figure out things for yourself. Okay, uh, let's see. So let's type in one feet menu. I want what do we got for spell casting? Armored spell casting, enhanced spell damage, familiars, penetration. Penetration, very, very, very nice. Helps you get through those. Ooh, faster memorization. What do you do? Three oh two. Decrease total memorization time each pulse or further reduce. No, I don't want that for right now. Quick chant. Cast spells fifty percent faster. Okay. Combat casting plus four to concentration. Okay. Yeah. You know, let's go back. I want to see meta magic feats. Maximize spell. Quicken spell. Definitely something to get later on as a sorcerer. Uh, let's see, seer. Excuse me. <clears throat> oh, what do I want for feet? Meta magic crafting, I will absolutely pass on. I do not need that. What do we got for combat feats? Blind fighting, improved initiative. Always tempting because attacking faster, more often things die faster. You know, always, always a good thing. Let's see here. Able learner, agile, deceitful, diligent, alertness. Gotta be alert. Magical aptitude. I, what is that one? Ah, no, I'll skip that. Skill focus. What about something to like bump up how quickly I get stuff back? Eh, you know what? Improved initiative it is. 
because, like I said, faster, always better. Oop, minus one, minus one. I can type, I swear. 62, yes. All right, I've got one general feat slot left. Uh, let's see, I also want, now I wonder, do they have leadership? That was another one of my favorites. No, no leadership. What's the negotiator do for me? Diplomacy and sense motive. Eh. Kind of going to try and I think go for, well, if I'm being completely honest, a somewhat munchkin-y build because, well, it's a mud and, yeah. Spell penetration. Yep. All right, let's go ahead and exit. Let's quit out of that. Known spells. First circle. What do I want? Let's see here. Level one. <laughs> Protection from evil, good. Ooh, they've got mage armor. Let's see, is there any way I can get like, can I type in like help Greece? No, no I cannot. Ah, that's a bummer. Hmm. Probably gonna want some sort of attack. Burning hands, charm, chill touch, color spray, enchant weapon, sleep, ID. Like, I don't know what Horizontal's Boom is. That's a new one to me. Shellgarn's Blade, I have no idea. Um, you know, let's go ahead and hit Q. Q. Preferred caster classes, Arcane, Wizard. Uh, no. Let's quit out of that right now. Uh, yes. Help spells. Spell list. Source. I'm just gonna scroll up and find that. Okay, so help Greece. What does Greece do for me? Penalizes their moves and makes it challenging to retreat. Eh. Okay. I was hoping I could like combo it with fire or something. Uh, chill touch. I imagine. Oh, chill touch. Duration four rounds plus magic level rounds accumulative. Cold damage. Yeah, that's about what I figured. Magic missiles, just straight up, well, it's magic missile. Everyone knows what magic missile is. If you don't, I can't help you. Ice dagger. Toss a magical dagger of ice at the opponent. It's reflex save. Okay, what about iron guts? I like the name. Improves fortitude, about what I figured. Mage armor, how good is it? Build stack, increases armor class, okay. Or is I calls. 
boom. It does sound damage. Okay, I like it. Can also deafen. What does being deaf do? Can't hear, can't receive communications. Can counter bard songs. Eh, okay. Shellgarn's Blade. It creates a dagger which serves the caster. Okay, so like it just summon your own minion. Kinda like that. Negative energy ray. Necromancy spell. And then there's of course burning hands. What about color spray? That one do damage I can never remember. Causes damage, possible to stun them. Won't work on monsters of a higher level. Okay. It's burning hands. They actually have as a touch spell. This is a damaging fire spell. Okay. Well, let's go ahead. So this command to get back to get into all that in the first place. It was study, I think. Let's try that. All right, known spells, first circle. I'm gonna pick up burning hands as well. So then we exit to the main menu. Exit to the main menu. Choose a familiar. Oh, I get a familiar. I get a familiar. A night hunter, a black panther, a mouse, an eagle, a raven, an imp, a pixie, or a fairy dragon. Mm, night hunter. I love the name. It, it just totally does it for me. So let's set some stats. You know, I really do like their implementation of the various D&D &D rules and whatnot here. You know, it's it's not super overwhelming, anything like that. Ooh, I've got 30 points. Awesome. Let's see here. Mm, I want, obviously, like, really high charisma. So let's bump us up. Wait, 16. What? All right, give me two more charisma. There we go. Okay. Did I? Oh, stats for at eight. They're not at 10. I'm a derp. All right. Okay, let's see here. Strength. I'm going to dump that to seven, I think. Oh, it puts me above slash below the stat cap. Lame. Okay. Uh, Dex. We'll go. Oh, not ten. I want to increase that by two. Constitution. As much as possible. Let's bump it up by four, I think. Yeah, intelligence. Ah, you know, wisdom, wisdom. Let's bump that to ten. How many points that leave me with? Six. Intelligence. Can we put that to like a fourteen? Sweet. Okay. Wouldn't mind a bit more dexterity, but that's fine. All right, cool. Let's quit out of that. Okay, choices have been finalized. So now if we go into study, if I go to known spells, nope, don't get any more. Let's see. Uh, yes, help minion. No, not minion. Help familiar. Usage, call familiar. Okay, help night hunter. No. Help familiar. Help call. Okay. Nope, help. Call dash. 
gives me call lightning. Uh, hell call sorcerer. Eh. Call familiar. Did I not? Oh, 900 stars following me. Oh, it's a bat. Awesome. Order. No order. What all can I make him do? Order. Followers. Follow. Me? No. Order. Followers. Follow. Svenel. Okay. So, got that. We check score. Stats are looking good that beautiful charisma bonus uh, if we check skills no uh spells train okay seeing some decent buffs to things intimidate is at a four of all things love it i can bluff i kind of want to pick up diplomacy eventually because diplomacy is always good so okay Let's go east and let's go west again. Help study and use feet info. Okay. Uh, let's go west again. Spells train. Oh, okay. Hey, cool. Say, teach me. Tell me about your magic system that I've already utilized a little bit. Okay, so I guess I don't get a tutorial. That's all right. Uh, do I have to prepare? No, prepare spells. Spell list. Sorcerer. Well, what if I just want to cast mage armor? Ah, cast mage armor. Casting mage. Oh, okay. Takes a little bit of time. If I check my effects, plus two to armor class. Nice. Ooh, abilities. I don't have any abilities. Cooldowns? Resistances. Spell resist, I don't got none of that. Oof, okay. Now if I check scores, is that tell me my armor class? Yes, armor class 12. Oof. Okay. Well, um, since they can't help me there, combat training room. Let's learn about combat. Help combat maneuvers. You stand, stand up. That yeah, makes sense. Use the attack command. Consider. Okay. All right. Combat maneuver bonus minus one. Defense eight. Main hand attack bonus minus one. Damage dice, D4. Oof, okay. So yeah, I'm definitely going to want to cast spells and things to kill him. Hello, half-elf Vykel, who is linkless and you don't show up and stuff. Nice to meet you. Or unmeet you, I guess. Nice little hallway. Nice little sign. East, crafting and shops, training, west, communication preferences. Do you all have something for sale here? No. What about here? Yes, you do. Cure crit, invisibility, see invisible. Yeah. But a crafting tutorial, why not? I say oh okay, there you go. I say ready, say next. Awesome. Take coins. I'll gladly take some coins. Let's buy a potion. 
walk potion. Now we can see invisible. We can check and see. Yep, can detect it for 40 minutes. I'm going to assume that this is in real time. Oh, hey. Okay, good to know there can be issues with this tutorial. Say ready. Let's see if it works. Okay, so we've got a ring mold. Get kit BP. Put ring kit. Awesome. Five pieces of material to put in the kit. Copper in kit. Put copper in kit. Bam. Put the copper in the kit. Oh. Put it in the last form. Look in kit. Small portion of copper. Uh, get copper kit. Put copper kit. <laughs> okay. Get copper kit. Put copper kit. Three of five, four of five, five of five. Okay, so it looks like it doesn't actually like hand you uh, five pieces of copper, but you can kind of cheat cheat the counter there. So, ooh, I get to name my own thing. So create a novice crafter's ring. Don't have enough materials. Need four more units of the same type. You know what? Do you have? No pelling kit. Small portion of copper. Get more kit. No. Okay. Bummer. You know. Wonder if they'll give me more copper if I go out and come in. Say ready. Oh, already started the tutorial. Bummer. So it checks for that, but communication training room, always handy. Need to know how to talk to people. Ask Francesca help. Francesca help. All right, Franny. I probably could just type in Fran. Ask Fran next. Let's examine this here board real quick. Chat, tell, whisper, shout. Okay, yeah. That's pretty normal. This door of the west, open door. Ask Vic. would never notice him. You know, I'm going to have to go and look at the two of them. Let's look at Vic. Average height, but it's very lengthy. So he probably has, like, gorilla arms on him, despite no muscle tone. So he's got these thin little noodle spaghetti arms. Wireframe glasses. You know, he, he kind of strikes me as a milady. All right. Yeah, I'm not going to worry about... Well, let's check out Pref Edit. I blame the slash r slash mud. Mud of the month promotion. And Luminari winning it. Oh, okay. Uh... On toggle preferences. Who boy? Auto exits. Always auto loot. Always auto gold. Uh, da, 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 da. Auto scan. Auto collect. Auto reload. Combat roll. GUI mode. You know, let's turn on GUI mode because I am using the GUI. No summon. No repeat. Brief compact. Yeah, we can skip all that. And we, 
Okay, MDSDP is already on. Excellent. So let's go ahead and quit out of all that. Yes, I do. Help pref edit, yada, yada, yada. Okay. Let's look at Fran. Form fitting black cotton dress, ends at her knees. So showing off them ankles, that hussy. Black hair, has glasses. If it wasn't for her bright smile and great presence, you'd only see a dark, evil being. All right, let's go north. Let's check around here. Stocky woman, it's called Anna. She used a social and greeted, greet Anna. Heard a ding noise. Is that my phone or is that? Oh, that was my phone. Okay. Uh, global emotes. Okay. Yeah, global emotes I'll probably avoid myself because, well, yeah. Where do I go from here? Alright, well, if we go back south, that's Francesca, so let's go back here. Oh, okay, right, right. North! Look at the sign. Group tactics, alright. Groups, commands related to Charmies, good to know. Group new. Excellent. Group. Also excellent. Group join, leader group's name. Type in report. Reports. Venal reports. Okay. Acquire charmies. Do, do, do. All right. So. Okay, so guy group them in so order followers. Order followers group joins Venal group. Excellent. And of course the bat is more healthy than I am. Okay, well thank you for that. Now the bat will help me. And that's a good thing. Let's go north. There's a stool training quest master. All right, teach me, oh wise quest master, about the ways of the quests. Quest list. Ah, itchy eye. Oh. Okay, that's better. Okay, um, let's quest join one, start that first quest. So there's a room in the dungeon below that sprung a leak. If it continues for long enough, it'll cause issues with the entire building. Yes, it will. Sinkhole would be awesome, though, if you didn't ever do this quest. Not gonna lie. Find the room and report back to Demic. So you find the correct room. 
Yeah, the completion message can lose in spam. Brr, brr, brr. Quest progress, quest history, and quest history number. So if we do quest progress, quest history. Okay, let's go down. Let's find ourselves. Oh, it's a dungeon master. Hold torch. All right. Can I scan? Oh, I can scan. But I can't see. Okay. All right, so we got quite the map here. Uh, let's go south. Restricted. Let's go north. Restricted. Let's go east. Restricted. Let's go west. All right. Thank you. Jagged rocks. It'll cut you for not paying attention. Sounds painful. Some more dungeon corridor. But let's see. Is it actually a different exit? No. Okay. So some repeated descriptions. But that's okay. Yeah. I mean. I can absolutely understand not wanting to describe every single room in a game. Hey, go back, Demic. Tell him about the room so we can send someone to repair it. So we do quest history. Quest history one. All right, well, let's go tell Demic that we finished that quest. Hi, Demic. All right, well, let's quest join two. Thief's been caught stealing scrolls from the spells trainer. He was last seen running from the training halls down to the dungeon. Lucky for us, there's no exit except for that stairway. Seek him out and kill him. All right, cast Burning Hands Thief. Let's copy that. Is he east? No. North? No. South. Ha ha. Hello, thief. Order followers. Kill thief. And I want to cast burning hands. Add to the queue. I start casting. I burn him to death. Oh, poor thief. Coins. Corpse is empty. Go back to the quest master. Take the next quest. All right, I can do that. Let's. Oop. Killing corpse, nothing there. Sack corpse. And they ignore it. Jerks. Studies my expressions. Mm. Quest list, quest join three. Ooh, treasure key. I like it. The bummer shirker, as we call them here, was found a way to live in the dungeons. It wasn't a problem, but it appears they've stolen the key to their treasure chest in the dungeons. Saw this woman with the key. Go kill her, get the key. Ooh, seems kind of harsh, but all right. All right, so she's going to be east. Ooh, there's a lever. Dirt's built on middle flooring from normal travels. East from wall, large slab. Oh, but is it already open? Can I pull the lever? Okay, what if I push the lever? No. Okay. Always worth checking. Ooh. All right. Let's go find us a shirker. Ooh. Mithril. Cast Burning Hands Shirker. Look, woman. Look. Oh, wait, Skirker? I thought they said Shirker. Oh, no. Okay, they said Skirker. Burning Hands Skirker. Order follower. Oh, okay, cool. So he already assisted me. Target, Venom, TC, good, standing. Uh, I nearly kill it with my deadly thrust. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay. All right, 
what's in that corpse. Get all corpse. Sweet. Let's harvest. Harvest vein. Need a mining skill of 48, which I am nowhere near. Okay, well, that's all right. Ooh, let's pull the lever. Gonna open up a wall. Gonna go through the wall. Yeah. All right. So quest list, quest, join four. There's a treasure chest contains an amulet of Ashen Port. It's a symbol of protection for the great city of Ashen Port. Bring it here and he'll reward my efforts. Okay. Unlock chest, open chest, get all chest, wear amulet. Yeah, yeah, all right. History for quest history quest list quest info for help quest commands help oh, quest progress that's right remove amulet uh, down up no give amulet to Demic ha. Use the portal to be in this area to exit to Mosswood where our next adventure begins. Kind of wanted to keep that amulet. Oh, hey, there we go. I just need to keep reading forward. Let's wear the amulet and head back to the south. I imagine all the south. That's right, training dude. Ford of the Mosswood. Look portal. Look human. Oh, that's right, okay. Uh, Enter portal. Okay. Sylvan the Blade Dancer. Let's look at Sylvan, see what we're looking at. Born of the Wind, sharp as a blade. Okay. Type enter portal is why it jumps straight into the game. Head south into our lovely village. What are they wielding? Rapiers? Oh, come on. If you're going to be a blade dancer, you got to have at least long swords. I mean, yeah, come on. Newbie trainer. All right. Well, I haven't gained a level yet. Can you actually train me? Oh, I've got trains. Okay, what about boosts? Do I have stat boosts? No stat boost, but I got trains. All right, help train. Improve abilities and skills, do so in specific locations. Okay, um, well, let's train. Let's spellcraft do me. Identify spells, access to epic spells, and what about lore? Identify objects and monsters, precise information. Okay. What about bluff? How successfully you can faint? What is faint? Successful, it'll be left flat footed, vulnerable sneak attacks. And, okay. Uh, let's see other skills. Skills. Uh, train, that's right. Concentration, I assume, makes me less likely to get. Okay, let's train concentration up because concentration's always important. Gives us a total of five. All right, can I train it more? Already trained, okay. Um, next up, let's get us some lore. Okay. Three more skills that I can max out. Uh, da, 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 da. Spellcraft, yeah. What does heal do? Uh, help, heal dash, skill. 
heals target for 10 hit points plus your heal ability rating times 2. Short cooldown. Ooh, that's... That's not too bad, actually. I mean... What else do I know? Cross class abilities. Oh, as much as I'd love to pick probably some of those up. I mean, ooh, perception. What does that do here? Spot hidden, hard to see things. Stealthers, hidden doors, traps, etc. Okay, well, we're gonna skip on that, I guess. So what's discipline do? Man, I, I get so distracted with this stuff sometimes. Ability to resist combat feeds each point. Risen. All right. Well then, let's train up on heal, because while well, hey, being able to heal yourself, never a bad thing. And let's train on use magic device. Okay, I don't actually have a magic device, yes, but hey, that's all right. Okay, and what else did you have to say when I walked in, trainer lady? Don't forget to type study. Well, if I type study, is there anything I can actually do yet? Mm, nope, I already got my spells, got my familiar. Set stats. Oh, like, oh, so you can adjust your stuff on the fly. That's cool. Okay. And that means I can probably also change my spells on the fly ish as well. Try not to abuse that if I can avoid it, but. Look props? No. Look plots. Look shrubs? Nope. Okay. Ask Elder Hi. Lots of ways to interact. Said ask ask Elder next. Quests involve asking keywords like these. Da, 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 da. He's got a quest. Please give me your rations to receive an award. Get ration from pack. Give ration to elder. Some cash? Okay. Quest join one. All right, auto quest system, but you already introduced me to that with Demic. But I guess if, you know, okay, if you didn't go through the newbie school, makes sense. And maybe I'll find her to the west. Oh, what are they saying over there? Help combat man. Is that like a combat manual? Oh. All right, all right, all right. Okay, let's go west. I found e Jolly. Wants me to kill me some, kill her some piglets. So if we go quest progress, I imagine. Yep. Okay. Uh, ask a jolly crops. Ask a jolly fields. No. Okay. Bell sits. Da, da, da. Oh, 
large oak tree, center of the village square. Looking for fields. Here, field, 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 field. Here, field, 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 field. Bushy path, the southeast, and the bushy path. Grazing field, okay. Can we find us any piggies? A horse, some more horses. Mercs, okay, not the way I want to go. Ah, piglets! Let's cast us some burning hands. Burnt them. Went from poor to bad. I missed my stab, so I'm gonna go ahead and. Oh, I didn't notice the little uh, little enemy. This is what's going on with them thing right there. So they're mortally wounded. Their hit points are dropping. I'm guessing they probably hit negative uh, 100 to actually die. You jolly yelled, thank you. Once you hit second level, help gain, you can join the next quest. Help quest points, what are those for? And I'm gonna go ahead and AFK here for a minute or two.
All right, everybody or nobody, which I think actually is just the case here. I'm going to go ahead and log and kill the stream for now. This has been my first hour with Luminary Mud. Um, so far, really digging it. I can actually kill stuff and cast spells from the get-go, which, uh, well, a couple of games I haven't been able to actually do that. So, yeah, this has been Tark. This has been the Stick in the Mud live cast. The game we were playing tonight was Luminary Mud over at LuminaryMud.com. And if you want to connect it, give it a shot. It's LuminaryMud.com, port 4100. And really, I think you should try it. Especially if you have any at all interest in D&D, Pathfinder, any of that. It's, so far, it seems like a really well put together game. The built-in graphical user interface that downloads automatically is pretty cool. Not going to lie. So, have a good one.